I'm Ryan Wise, I work in the Insurance and Public Risk Department. I've currently completed my Level 3 Legal Apprenticeship with Salex Law School. Um, I still wanted to develop my skills and knowledge and progress as a person, but classroom training isn't really for me, so university wasn't really an option. Whereas this, you're learning on the job, as well as still getting your qualifications at the same time. We started off, we've got um, competence units, so things like filing, um, communicating with clients, etc., which we have to show um, that we that we can do. Um, we've got a Salix Law School tutor that came in to assess the work and watch us do these uh, types of things to, to verify that we can do it. Um, we also got um, practice units, which the Salix Law School tutor came in and taught us in classrooms. Um, and then we took exams in those in summer and January exams. I work in motor mainly doing small claims and credit hire, but I also do a lot of debt recovery work for a large um, energy supplier. Um, you get paid while you're learning, you, you're getting work experience at the same time, so I think you've got that advantage over people doing the university route because you, you've already got on the job knowledge. So I'm going to carry on doing the level 3 exams and then do the level 6 exams and qualify as a legal executive. Then I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do after that in terms of qualifying as a solicitor and converting it or not. It depends what happens over the next few years and what the life situation is. Yes, I would. I think it depends on your learning styles and whether apprenticeships would suit you or not because everyone's individual and different, but I would definitely recommend it if, you're, if you want on-the-job training but still want to progress and develop more skills.